Sasha, from our perspective, uh, straightforward win. Um, tricky in that second set tiebreaker. Curious to know, what are you most happy with? I thought he played some amazing tennis, uh, especially in the end of the second set. I thought uh, he was actually the better player than me. Um, but, you know, I fought, I found a way, and uh, of course I'm happy to be done in three sets and uh, to have some rest. It's, you know, very tough conditions, very hot today, so um, I'm pleased with that. Speaking of hot, you've been hot on tour. You are now leading the tour with, I believe, 54 wins. I mean, you're playing unbelievable tennis. French Open final, beautiful to see, especially after what happened two years ago. Um, what's been the key this year? I mean, have you set new goals, different goals, a different routine, or it's just more of the same? Well, to be honest, uh, as you said, two and a half years ago when I got injured at the French Open, um, I didn't know whether I was ever going to be back playing at this level. And, um, I, I, you know, I had so many doubts in my mind. I had, uh, question marks whether I was ever going to be top 10, top 5 in the world and um, to be honest what changed is I'm enjoying every single moment. I'm enjoying um, every single moment on these beautiful courts in front of you know thousands of fans. It's, um, it's, something, it's something that was taken away from me two and a half years ago and um, you know I'm extremely glad to be playing this level and hopefully, hopefully I'll give myself the best chance to win here. A uh, couple of random questions for you outside of tennis. I'm so jealous of the fact that you speak multiple languages. Sasha, when you're on the court, what language do you speak to yourself in? It depends who I'm talking to. <laughs> if it's, uh, if I'm swearing, then probably something you guys don't understand, but only my box understands. If it's uh, interaction with the crowd and in English, but, um, yeah, it, it depends whether it's positive or negative. When it's positive, probably English. When it's negative, any other language but English. <laughs> oh, man, absolutely incredible. Um, again, you talked about some of the doubts you had getting back to this level. You have done it. It's tough to do it once, but to have to do it again is, is incredible. So enjoying tennis, but do you still have high expectations when you come to an event like this? Yeah, of course. I mean, I'm, I'm back in the top four of the world. Um, you know, I was one set away from winning the French Open this year. I've won a Masters event this year again, so um, I'm, I like to brag about myself. You know, I'm in love with myself. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> no, but look, I, I have the same goals now that I had before the injury, and that was always doubtful in my mind whether I was ever going to be at the level again, and uh, of course I'm extremely happy about that. I go into these kind of tournaments with the mindset to win, and um, yeah, I mean, I, ju I just got to do it one time. Well, your game is earning you the right to brag. I know we love you here in New York. Make some noise, everyone. Sasha Zverev. <laughs>